Hello everybody, welcome to round two of Blitz Pit Teams in the winner's bracket up against Chug Man Milk, who's imagining Flicky on High Elves <laughs> uh, with very funny Flicky related names. This is interesting, isn't it? He's got five Blodgers slash Rogers uh, with all of his skills stacked on five players. Um, two skills stacked on five players. It's pretty decent. I think Broils would be better. But uh, he's got three rerolls. He's got an apple. He's got eleven men. He's got some armor eight. Um, like, you know, because the the elves get the get the the pro elf catches are better than high elf catches, and the blitzers are better than blitzers. And then you've got five of them all skilled up. I like it. You know, and six rookies. I do think in this kind of format, pro elves are better. Um, they would have also got a, a, a reserve, I believe. But you know, this is this is very hard to handle, especially for a team without tackle. And unfortunately, of course, I have got no tackle. So it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be difficult, um, but I think I've just got to you know concentrate on the uh, on the stabilization. I mean we should be okay. Like that was the thing the thing that I learned against PTK was really prioritize stabilization versus the L's. So that that's the that's the thing I think. And uh, Fimey will do the commentary. Thank you very much, Fimey. I'm going to try hard. Hello everybody. Here we go. High Elves versus Necro. Wrestler go, uh, Golf is a. Uh, and also the frenzy tackle that they used to call it. In fact, someone already said the. Uh, already said the poor man tackle thing. Chooks choose to defend. Oh, oh man, oh shit, I'm not mute. I'm so fucking tempted to like go going hard on the chat game here against Chugs. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so tempted. I'm just gonna mute myself. Right, Chucks to guard, Russell. Lucas all right. I'm not very sure who's going to be able to uh, take the ball, Jim. I guess we'll see. LOS blocks working, not bad, one arm break and nothing. Oh, an eight, that will be an arm break on a pro elf. I think that's gonna be all armor rolls for uh, Jim from now on, it's gonna be eight. Here comes the danger. He has to roll that because leaving the ball on the floor and he helps, not good. Blitzing with a song. Oh, get in the power, gas. Choose go for the skillless zombie.
game on chat. Why? Anything right now. A lot of blood in front of uh, Jimmy's team. Yes, let's come into the Skyless Lino. Chooks doesn't have any bench, and if uh, Jimmy manages to kill someone, gets an extra player, armor break. Jimmy gravitating towards the right side of the pitch. And now, what to do with the rest, guys? Close the door with the. Looks pretty prepared, the classic screen. Oh, he's going to invest the guard uh, piece there. Block does the job, and now, yes, uh, move back. And Jimmy has a very easy hit on the, the wrestler. He wants to do it. And also turn three. So Jimmy can afford to do that if he wants. She's going deep. Oh, juicy target here. He gets the power. Not on the first hit. Neither in the second one. Oh my god, I was going to have a guy for the follow-up hit and just haven't moved him. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god, that's horrendous. Oh my god, I'm so bad at Blood Bowl. Jesus Christ. The Necro Fever got you. Fantastic shit at this game. Thrower with leader saves you 10k. Because the rerolls are 50k. Uh, throwers are 10 or 20k more exp. But you get an extra player. And now, yes, uh, easy to be on the wolf here. <laughs> ha, there he goes. Bleed. Is he going to sharp the wolf? Looks like it. Yeah. 
Sí. Mars. As the ancient scrolls the last to do. And of you all. Brutal. Maximum punishment for the. Oh, but he managed to regain. Yes, Rain is a. Lucky Jimmy there. Of course, the Spanish love our cooking. Best in the world. Not mine, but I'm a Spanish. Back there, and we're gonna be here. What's going to be the blitz? Other oh. block, let's block again. This is looking complicated for Jimmy right now. Especially because he has three seconds left. Okay, power there. Gonna be another eight in the armor roll. No, it's a set. Power there. Oh, and gets the cast. And the send off and the apple is an apple. That was around the apple, considering it was just a line. Two men down for uh, Jimmy, but the wolf will come back. And he has a reserve to. He's fine. He will be 11. Dodge. Here we are, turn five, and Jimmy needs something to happen. Okay, gets the power. Come on, Jimmy, kill something. An armor record. And we are here, we are again with all the uh, Jimmy's team. Building a bunker, surrounded by uh, the other team. I think we have seen this before. Also, Johnny Five, if you do know how I sound ready in a grocery list, I can tell you my grocery list for uh, today. One, command the blitz speed game. Two, tell J5 to fuck off. Fuck off, J5. Well, that's it. Done. Free for the weekend. <laughs> 
All right, back to the game. <laughs> now, this is, these games are horrible. I, I prefer when uh, there are a lot of mighty blow and crow and half the teams are dead. So I don't have to think. Not that I don't think much anyway, but... Turn 6 for G. And there is like 7 million blocks step in front of the... Let's remember that they also PTK and uh, Purple Chest are playing at the same time. And one of them can afford to lose the game. The other two must win. Okay, going fishing for pause. Doesn't get it. It's a 30%. which depends who you ask, is uh, guaranteed every single time or never happen. And now Jimmy is even more cage. Okay, let's be honest, guys. That's a lot of elves there. It's a lot of elves there. Yeah, it's a resurrection format. Whatever happens, it's okay. Lucky lad, reroll invested there. I think that's a good investment. General turn six, and he had three rerolls. Something. That didn't regain. Banger Elves. Banger High Elves. Absolute dice. So Jimmy can uh, get up the other one. Blitz with something. That's all right. This is really, really rich. now. I think we are very close to maximum density of players per square that I've seen in a Blood Bowl game. Let's go PTK, let's go uh, Purple Chest. Come on, guys, you can do this. And remember, guys, this is, uh, this is Jimmy's drive. It's not over, it's not over. It could be a miracle uh, happening now and Jimmy 
killing uh, three of the elves. That could happen, it's possible. It's a dice game. Is it gonna happen? I wouldn't put my money on it, but never know. Oh, that move there allows to Jimmy to try to find an opening. He can 2D with the white. Van Milk read that play and uh, counter it. Fails. Snake it, I think. And now Jimmy has a uh, opening. It's not the best opening I've ever seen, but it's an opening. And he has uh, rerolls to use. Oh, gets the power. Oh, imagine a, a death now. How beautiful would it be? Another pow. I don't think you follow it. And Jimmy scores! Ooh! Ooh! Yes, I've seen a lot of openings in uh, my life. And that was it. I think it was uh, maybe easier if you didn't, didn't follow with the fleshy. There was the other square, I don't know. Happens too quick, it happens too quick. But yeah. Three players down, he has one reserve. So yes, that's the Jimmy starting the next half with nine. And many of them are absolutely really zombies. But he gets the mighty blow back. He has the guard, he has the wrestle wolf, wolf, he has his wolfies. Everybody knows that Sugar Mac Milk is a horrible human being. Maybe there is some just. Also, he's playing with fate, pulling off his player's flick. That's probably the riskiest move I've ever seen ever uh, anyone doing uh, in Blue Oh, IDGA, the magic codes from Doom. Kids nowadays doesn't know what that means. We lost our ways. Here comes the one turn. As a lot of people moving. For impartial, yes, impartial. Also, I'm not here to be impartial. I'm uh, commenting uh, the game and it's a very well-known fact that Chuck McMill is a horrible human being. You can ask anyone on chat and they will confirm. Because they, they are also horrible human beings. One turn keeps advancing. Slowly but surely. Ha! 
And I think that was the last push that was needed. And now time to pass the ball. And that's why you don't need a thrower because you have movement eight players. Absolute toxicity doing the dodges next to the wolf. I managed to score one one. Ooh, things are looking rough for Jimmy. Flicky is up one nil at half. That was a nice one turn by Chuck McMill, but also having a full team uh, helps a lot. <laughs> to go lucky, he should, he should have said, Chuck, was he a Sammy's click? Okay, uh, I've seen the Mahjong thing coming up a few times. What's the, what's the thing with Mahjong and uh, Chukman Milk? Okay, for Chanlaki. I have a feeling that the fleshy is going to survive. And there goes the cast. Who needs mighty blow or anything? You know, when you have high elves. Because the ball. For the high rolling. Last night. We were very close to see the wolf dodge there. They're already in cast because both of them are very old man, old men, and they need to uh, to be able to read. <laughs> oh, there you go! I mean, protecting for the failed state on this uh, blitz. Double pow, yes. Quietly. Survives. Pressing result. Never seen it in my life. Dodge. Job. Uh, 
Now to say, guys, having a lot of strength in the three uh, blotch players helps a lot in this format. Well, I think there is a lonely line now that is going to be punched in the face. Armor break, at least finally something happened. And he has done the same mistake that the other on the first half, just in the opposite side of the pitch. Coming here, communication face as they used to call. Now every single move that you do on Blue Devil is a face. The move in the ball face. Faking the attack to advance face. Real tag in time face. You can imagine. No armor break, amazing, unbelievable images. I don't know how to react to this. We have seen, we are seeing dice we haven't seen ever before. Yes, but I mean, I also eat heal, you know, like Dio, that's who sat on a higher state of being. That's good advance uh, by uh, uh, Chooks. But leaving that door open there, we believe uh, Jimmy were able to roll up out a million years. Oh, there you go. Oh, finally. Finally! Ball is stuck. Ball is stuck by a guard fleshy on a blodger. I don't know how you can uh, escape from that. I have no idea how Chug is going to be able to free that uh, the ball carrier because the fleshy has some farms. It's the ultimate skill. Now, if the elves want to score, they can do it, but that's perfectly fine for uh, Jimmy because we hit him a lot of times. Now is the moment where you sneak this and everybody laughs at Chuck. Or maybe. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible how that the uh, player. Uh, Escape from the stand firm piece. Maybe some hacks that Chuck is uh, using or something like that. I don't know.
now uh, choosing in uh, what the uh, PC used to say solid positioning Jimmy attacking the weak points here, which is the line. If this was a pro earth team, those bleachers with the, you know, blood guard, if it was a pro earth team, would also have side step. Just imagine the name. Here, Jimmy, uh, so in a uh, choose the Canadian defense. You no know, indicating clearly the path to score. And Chooks goes back to the center. Ooh, ooh. Re roll spend there. Overtime format. And Jimmy has four re roll. Here is the main problem. Jimmy needs to create some danger soon because it's going to be turn 13 for him, turn for the elves, and the elves, if they score, they go 2-1. I can see I can see that because in big numbers and the higher part of the thing, they're 1-1. A second. <laughs> Armor break. Blockless blitz. Mm, you, you, that's weird. Usually those are uh, pure pause. Ooh. So get the pound or the both down. Gain ball tag by Stanford. This time, guys, this time is the real one. I see a snake. Clearly snakes. Impossible to escape. Oh my god! This is the He can do it twice. It's impossible. No man can do it. Bob's dodge. I managed to do it.
Okay, Jimmy, you need to think this through. Don't be GFI. That's it. Whoa, whoa. What place are we seeing here? All right, wrestler. Dojo Manual, Sigeni. the magic legendary uh, necro wolf dodge that all of you were waiting for followed with by the wgf five of a fleshy that's it guys all the mix are coming together The frenzy trap was probably the last uh, one to do. Casual three plus. Double GFI, not even using the reroll. Four rerolls, hand 15. Oh! Oh! Class. Not even dead. Third time that, that that piece dodges away from a, a stand firm piece. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oh, Pop Dodge. Ah. one there that's that's a good case that chooks are there but <laughs> He's right, that's a double negative. He can up kill and then the red dice. No, he can do one dice. Now even two dice. Not many chances of this working, guys. Mm, and I think that's all. Jimmy has one turn. Two wolves, one elf. We all know that now he's gonna Jim is gonna roll double pause and kill and then just random. PC one. What do you mean, capital like five or six? Oh. 
Ο Ανέλιο της 1-0 up, αν είσαι στο drive. This could be good. But also a lot of people uh, doesn't know what to do with the extra square and it's a complete disaster. Yes, but I mean, I play it, all right, but PTK are so goodies. That's a lot of damage there. That's nice. Moving away the players, so he can use them wide. Let's go to overtime. Important. Moving at one. Okay, so kids with the uh, fleshy. First one with the fleshy. Oh, first one moves that one there, yes. Now hits with the fleshy. Three dice. Tragedy, absolute tragedy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oof. Oh well, my god. Well, his one turn attempt worked a bit better than mine. <laughs> well <laughs> I call it, you know, and now it's when Jimmy is gonna kill the line no. Yeah, I mean yeah, I'm, I'm, done. And, uh, I'm done. I won one nil. Glory. He lost. Core, I think, is well, he's just put an update. It is nine versus six. Core has the ball, but blitz to flicky to make it less great. So I guess that's overtime. So Kaur's ball, he's got six versus nine Woodies. Uh, but he's got the ball, unless this blitz screws it. Right. I'll well, still wrap up the I'll wrap the up the YouTube video first there anyway. So yeah, right, congrats. Sorry. Congrats, Chugs. Um we're gonna look at this match now for the like, you know, the live things, uh PTK's match for the uh for the group matches. But um thank you very much, Faimir, for the commentary. Absolutely glorious. Glorious, and I have time to even read my grocery list. <laughs> right, <laughs> and uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.